So the Peter Marsh handicap chase is next then. So pretty big race, famous old race. It's a Grade Two handicap. It's over three miles, and the top one is Spaniards in Darren Thompson, Wild Bill, Paul Rhodes, Little Jim, David Robertson, Ravilla de la Plata, Paul Rhodes, Destan, Thunderspark, Consequence of Stars, Joshua Sutherland, Arm Quackers, Kevin Meenham, Powerful Beast, Molly and Surfer, Durkast. Thunderspark, Napoleon Gray, Stu Gray, Standout King, Darren House, Tommy Gunn, Kevin Minahan, Fasson Melancholique, Martin Leedham, Magic Muldoon, Martin Leedham, Hawthorne, James Follis, and April the 7th, Graham Clutterbuck. 16 of the men. April the 7th for Graham Clutterbuck. Used to be a real horse, I think, called that. Remember? You say one day when did April the 7th fall on Boxing Day? I think ran in the King George. Anyway, where are they go then? And Villa de la Plata. Probably just the first to show, they sort themselves out and go straight into a left hand turn. And the great Durkast is going to be the one that takes them along from Wild Bill in second. Powerful Beast is third, and Hawthorne, you can see there, Powerful Beast pulling for its head. If they go a little bit faster than a jockey wants to let it. And once again, poor old Darren Howes' horse is ruined really wide, that standout king. So it's a fair old run of the first, they've finally got to it, and over it they go, and they're all over it okay. With Dirk has to lead them by a good four lengths. To Wild Bill second. Spaniards in, moving up nicely on the outside. To take a share of third with Powerful Beast, then Consequence of Stars and Hawthorne. As they take the second, and we see them racing away from us, down towards the third, which comes up pretty quickly. Dirk has the grey, has a commanding early lead of five lengths. To Wild Bill, Spaniards in. Consequence of stars as they get to the third. We'll skip over that one. A, bit of a slow jump at the back by a little gem. But got over it okay. Durkasted is in front. From Wild Bill. Spaniards in still going a little bit wide on the track. The grey getting a bit closer there is Napoleon Grey. The second of the greys is Dest down with a third of the greys. Durkast is a grey in the lead. The fourth of the greys towards the back is little gem. And on Quackers is just about... The back marker at this stage, and as they take that ditch, looking over that one, okay. The back four are getting a little bit detached. Tommy Gun, Magic Muldoon, Little Gem, and I'm Quackers. And Durkas must be sitting at a pretty stiff pace. Leads by four, then. Swinging left handed again with Wild Bill in second. Consequence of Stars third, and Spaniards in four. Hawthorne is five, and then April the seventh, and Napoleon Grand in powerful beast. Fasson Melancholique is just tucked in behind them. Then Death Down and Standout King as they take the sixth. And over that one, they all go a good jump towards the back by Magic Muldoon. Durkast is the leader, and it looks like they're going to do a bit of jockey camming on this little gem. Has it been named after a lettuce? I don't know. As they take the next, over it they go. You can see Chucky pull it to the outside to try and get a bit of a clear sighting of the eighth fence. And Magic Muldoon has gone while we're jockey camming, so that's the first one out of the race. Skip over that one, okay. okay. See that little Gem's made up some good ground while we've been on the back of him. Oh, uh, come down to this one in front of the stand now, then back to a more traditional view. And over it they go. And they are very well strung out now. As we see them from the stand racing past the big screen and the winning post. And out for one more circuit. Paid up. Now uh, we're losing one at the back there. Villa de la Plata is being pulled up. So that's one out of the race. That would be one of the fancy ones I would have thought. Now uh, Durkast is giving these a bit of a test. Wild Bill is in second. Then comes Consequence of Stars. He's about three lengths behind in third. Then Spaniards in. And April the 7th, Napoleon Gray still going well on the outside, trying to give Stu Gray a quick double. Then Hawthorne, standout kings after that one as they take the 10th. And over that one they all go with on quackers somewhere adrift of the remainder. But it's Durkast in the lead then from Wild Bill in second. Then Consequence of Stars is third. Napoleon Gray's four and April the 7th is fifth as they take the next. Over that one they go, they all got over it okay. Fasson Melancholic is now dropped to the back as on quackers has been pulled up. So Durkast is the leader still. Led all the way so far. Not seen another horse really. Wild Bill is in second as they take the 12th. You see them over that one, they get away from us and they race down towards the next with Durkast in the lead. Wild Bill chasing in second. Then Consequence of Stars is third. April the 7th is four. Napoleon Gray is five. Spaniards in is six. We're losing Little Gem at the back. 
Now then, after that one, Destan and Hawthorne stand out. King is getting closer, so to Fast on Melancholy as they take the 13th. And over that one, Little Gem, as we said, has just been pulled up. Hawthorne is now the back marker. Durkast in front then. Still, as he takes that ditch, gets over it well, gets away from it well. Leads still three lengths to a pushed along wild bill. Here comes April the seventh round the outside of consequence of star standout. King looks to be going well. Spaniard has been there throughout. Napoleon Gray's lost its place. Now Hawthorne starting to run on. Powerful beast has been quite for the last mile or so trying to get back into it. Tommy Gunn running on fast on Bell on Kalik and then finally Destan at the back. But now Wild Bill hits the front. Wild Bill takes it up over the fifteenth. Wild Bill lands in the lead, gets away from it nicely. Durkast now the one doing the chasing in second. Spaniards in his third. Then consequence of stars on April the seventh and Napoleon Gray. They've got just three furlongs to race. They race down to the third last. Over it they go. And Wild Bill's gone clear. Wild Bill's gone for home. Consequence of stars is in second. April the seventh is running on third. Then Durkas dropping away. Napoleon Gray trying to get up the inside. Standout King still looks like a double handful. But it's Wild Bill in the lead. Wild Bill with two to jump. Wild Bill gets over it nicely. April the seventh second. Then Spaniards in and consequence of stars. It's Wild Bill they've got to get to. But it's April the seventh that's beginning to make ground. Wild Bill in the lead from April the seventh. One to jump. Wild Bill now beginning to tire and April the seventh looks to be going best. Takes the lead over the last. April the seventh in front. Wild Bill Durkast now coming back for another go. It's April the seventh and Durkast is back in the lead again. Led all the way. Got headed and has now come back through to take it up. Standout King starting his run far too late and at the line Durkast wins it. What a good win. Death down fast on melancholy ran on well towards the end as well. But Durkast. What a strange performance from that horse, led all the way, dropped right out of it and then came back again at the end. Durkast the winner for Thunderspark, Standout King ran a good race with Darren Howell second, that'll win over further. April the 7th for Graham Clutterbuck was third, Destan for Thunderspark was fourth and Fasson Melancholique ran on into fifth.